What's going on guys, Killerbird here, and today, in this video, we're going to be going over some Destiny, uh, Festival of the Lost, Easter Eggs 1. As you guys can see here, this uh, robot here has no broom. It looks like she lost her broom, and she's not even holding one. Well, there is a way you can actually help her with that. Alright, so if you go down here to uh, the hangar, the tower hangar. And if you go into the un the uh, underground area or of the hangar, uh, you can actually get um, by the um, what's it called the kiosk for the emotes. There is a tall shelf, and you can pick something up from there. And I'll show you guys that in a minute. As you guys can see there, there is a broom on the top of that shelf over there. So we can hold X and recover that. And as you guys can see, we found the Lost Broom, which is a sparrow. And with this, this sparrow, um, it looks like a broom, of course. But the thing is, is that it expires at the end of Festival Lost. So you only get it for two weeks. And you can only drive around on it for two weeks. And there's another Easter egg that I'm going to show you guys. But in order for me to do that, I'm going to have to switch characters. So, I will be right back. So... Alright guys, we are back, and this next easter egg I'm going to be showing you is a shader easter egg. So in order to start this shader easter egg off, if you guys remember last year's Festival of the Lost, you got this tiny box of raisins. And if you kept it through this year, you'd get the Ascended Raisins, or Ascendant Raisins. And if you don't have the Ascendant Raisins and you just started off Destiny today and started the Festival of the Lost, in order for you to get the Ascendant Raisins, you are going to want to take that tiny box of raisins to the speaker, and you will have to trade that in and 25 motes to get the Ascendant Raisins. Alright, so once you get the Ascendant Raisins, what you need to do is then go to the um, uh, Zavala, which is the Titan Vanguard. The Tekken King defeated, but not destroyed. Right. And guys, we are going to go over that Sparrow too. So what you got to do is you got to go over to Zavala. And then you trade in the uh, Ascendant Raisins for Salted Sweet. And as you guys can see, this quest, or this Easter Egg, doesn't have any quest indicators. So then you want to go to the Cryptark. Right after you go to Zavala. And then he will trade you a winged chew. And then you take that, trade that, and then you go to the shipwreck, shipwright, which is Amanda Holiday, which is right here in that tower hangar. So really all this Easter egg is, is you have to run around and figure it out by yourself and trade stuff with people. Alright, and then here's Amanda Holiday, and you want to trade her those uh, wing chews for uh, splice drops. And then, second to last, what you want to do is then go to um, Cade, which is the Hunter Vanguard, which is down by Zavala, if you guys don't already know that. Which is right down here. You have here we go. And you want to trade him those splicer candies for unchocolate. And then what you want to do is then, after you talk to Cade, lastly, you want to talk to uh, Eris, which is right here underneath the stairs. And you want to get a bag of treats. And then you obtain that bag of treats, and then you go in your inventory, and then what you want to do is you want to hold X and use it, and you obtain the shader and a piece of celery. Actually, I have no clue what the celery does. 
And guys, I already have all the shaders in this new update. So let's go through them all. Here's Super Black, which is a shader you get, which is pretty much all black and it looks sick. And then that's the Easter egg shader. And then here are all the other shaders you can get in the update. Um, in order to get the Unquiet Spirit, I believe you have to uh, finish a quest line. Or no, you obtain it in uh, Crucible from Drops, uh, which we'll take a look at right now. And it's all green. Um, next shader is the Sea of Tears, which you get from filling up this bag of full, this full candy satchel. You turn that into um, the person, the mask giver, which is the shader seller. And she will give you uh, a choice of a bag. Uh, I don't remember a bag of treats and it give you the shader and something else and then you get this and then candlelight I actually have no clue what this one's from But sea of tears is just really blue Which is cool as well and then candlelight like I said, I have no clue how you get this one uh, Comment down below how you get it. I got I think I got it from uh, A skeleton key chest or whatever so that's just purple and that actually looks really cool um we're going to keep super black on because why not? And then those are the two Easter eggs. And actually, guys, we are actually going to do one more thing in this video here today. We are not here just to show. I'm going to show two of the East, which I already did, the Easter eggs. And we're actually going to get, yeah. um, I bought 200 silver and we're going to buy, uh, 10 of these packages here. And we are actually going to see what we get from the Halloween update. And as you guys can see, when I was in my inventory, I got the new Howl uh, emote, which is pretty much you howl like a wolf, which is sick. And the only way you can get that is if you buy it, which is stupid. So, guys, let's jump right into opening some of those packages I just bought. So, in, you, in these uh, Treasures of the Lost, you are able to get these Halloween masks, Revenant mask, Ghost mask. Axis Mask, Wolf Mask, Siva Mask, Oryx Max, Petrovenge, Eris, Legendary Engrams, and all these other ones. And then you get these uh, ornaments for Bad Juju. The Fire Wolf Max, the f ugh, excuse me, the Fire Wolf Mask is actually the one I really, really want. As you guys can see, that looks absolutely sick. And then I want, there is a Sparrow Jealousy, which is actually really cool. And here's a look at it really cool texture on it and then you get these two ghosts too so let's open these up see if we get duplicates yeah duplicates or not so let's open some of them up right now first one is we got the revenant mask sleepless gaze and the jackalite next package is uh skullos mask crawl of creeps and worm of cow how i don't know how to pronounce that next one lost prince mask and I will be going over all these masks too. Seven. The Warden Mask. Bad Dreams. Sleepless Gaze. Bad Dreams and a Jackalite. That was a trash one. Another trash one, really? Stroke of Midnight. Alright guys, sorry about that. My uh, thing cut out. My Elgato cut out. So let's just continue. We got four more. Sadly, and we didn't really get anything so far. Next one, we got Sleepless Gaze. What the hell? Is it just going to give us trash now? Seems like it. Come on, you got to give me something good on the last one. Really? Wow, just really. And we got the Devil Ghost for the last one. Oh, that actually really aggravates me because... It gave us crap for the last ones. And here's the Devil's Ghost. Devil Ghost. That actually looks somewhat cool. And then let's go over all the masks. We didn't get any duplicates, but these are the ones I already have. Uh, we got the Revenant Mask. Well, which looks like that. And actually, it looks like we got more things from our Postmaster quick. Let's grab this. Holy shit! No, we got a whole bunch more. Never mind. Oh, yes. And we cannot transfer anymore because our inventory is full. But guys, we actually got all the masks with no duplicate.
duplicate. We got both of the wolf masks. Are you kidding? Ah, uh, let's go. Actually, let's throw some of these masks in here and let's show off the one I really care about. Alrighty then. So let's just... For some reason, I can't hold throw that one away. Or not throw it away, but grab it. So there is the Revenant mask. And I have the tiger one in there. But the, the only one we really care about is this one this one and actually this one looks pretty cool i might as well i'm gonna grab the ones that i would like to show off and actually instead of just showing them off slowly i'm gonna go into the kiosk thing again there's the revenant and here's the one we've all been waiting for the wolf mask the flaming wolf mask let's see that howl actually i forgot to say if you use the howl and you have this mask it turns blue that which is quite a cool little easter egg thing there we got the blue one the normal wolf mask, which I don't think does anything if we do it. Oh, let's see. We got the ghost mask. So then we can hold our little ghost next to us. That's actually a pretty cool mask right there. Um, we also got the Axis mask, which is the raid boss helmet. Or not helmet, the raid boss, the final raid boss. That actually looks really cool too. Better than the orc one and the proto one. And then we also got the Zer mask, which I'm not going to actually put it on. I'm just going to view it. That actually looks really cool. Look at that. And then, where is it? Petrovenge. Eh. No, I don't like that one. And then the Siva Mask. And here are the things we could have got from these packages, which we did not, but that's alright. We could have got, um, let's see here. We could have got these, uh, ornaments. We could have got the Jealousy Sparrow, which we did not. That's alright, but at least we got the wolf, fire wolf mask, ghost shell, and the mask I want. The mask I wanted to get. That's really all I care about. And there we go. And actually, guys, let's put the fire wolf mask on. Where it is. Here it is. And let's go test out that broom. And I will jump right to the Cosmodrome. Alright guys, we made it to the Cosmodrome, and let's check out that Sparrow here. Actually, just beforehand, let's, let me just show off that emote again, and it already went off again. There's the Howl emote with the wolf mask. And let's check out the Sparrow here. Here you go. <laughs> just ride around in a little broomstick here, look at that. And look at my wolf mask, his skill, flaming blue. Would you look at that? Can you do tricks off this is the question. You know what sucks about this is that you can only have this for two weeks. And that sucks. Because you can just ride around on a broomstick. Which is... Can you do the dances on here? Let's try it. Let's see if we can dance on here. Quick one. Or did they patch that? I'm not entirely sure on that. There used to be a glitch where you could dance on your spell. And I'm not going to try it. Let's just test what I wanted to test, which was jumping off and doing flips. So pretty much, guys, this is really the Easter egg. You get a broomstick. You can ride around. You can do your horn. But the test is I want to see if you can do tricks on it. And it didn't. The button that I was pushing down to do a trick didn't work. So let's do that one more time. That was a complete fail. Wow. Wow, I don't. Why won't it work? It won't work on that jump, really? Let's try it this way. Yeah, you can do tricks on it. That's actually really cool. Alright. Guys, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment down below what you think of the video. And I will see you guys in the next video.